guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Brianna and today I'm back with another fun review for you from Lush Cosmetics. And this one is the Festive Friends Fun. Now this variety of fun was brought out for Christmas 2018, I believe. I'm just going to double check my notes. Yes, this is a Christmas 2018 product. So the main sort of ingredients for this one, you've got corn flour, talc, glycerine, You've got sodium lauryl sulfate, lime oil, sweet wild orange oil, olibanum resinoid, gardenia extract, and some other little bits and pieces. So I tried to find some information on this in terms of a scent family and those sorts of things. I didn't get a ton of information for it. Uh, what I did get is that it shares the scent uh, with the Nevermind the Ballistics Bath Bomb. Um, I haven't used any of the ballistic style Products. Those are way before my time uh, with Lush, but if you are an older Lushy or you've been a Lushy for quite a while, you may remember the Nevermind the Ballistics Bath Bomb and that might trigger some scent memories for you. So that's the closest comparison in scent that I can get. For those of you who are sort of like me, who may have a little bit of knowledge on Lush, but you don't know everything, I do see similarities with this and the Celebrate Scent family. Um, so if I just lift this lid off, yeah, I do see a similarity, but it's sort of like distant cousins. I wouldn't say they're friends and I wouldn't say that they're brother and sister. That's pretty much how I would say it. There's definitely less strength in the lime oil in this. Like it's not as citrusy and fresh as the Celebrate scent normally is. And this is more sweet and not boozy sweet like Celebrate often is because of the cognac oil in it. This is definitely more that sweeter side of things. Now, for those of you who might be newer to Lush and you don't know what the heck Celebrate is or what I'm talking about with that either, the best way I can describe the scent is it's sort of, it's this sweet citrus scent, but it's it's a candy-ish sweet. It's not a natural sweetness. It definitely has a very candy-like scent and it's very intoxicating. You feel almost uh, like you're going on a bit of a journey with it, if that makes sense. It almost smells like a citrusy candy, but there is a soapy quality to this as well. Um, once again, Celebrate doesn't tend to have that soapy quality, uh, and this definitely has a soapy quality to it. Um, now, I'm going to try and move some of these around. Um, it's a little bit hard to see where I have used the product, but I am going to just go this side, I think. You can sort of see all the different colours there. I have used some from the top. I'm not going to fuff about and use all the different colours, but I did smell each individual layer and they all smelt exactly the same. So that tends to be the way with the fun tubs. Even the different colours will have the same scent. So you're not going to have different scents for each layer normally. Sometimes they do do it, but I'm yet to see it. Um, and they've got all these little sort of things that you can use if you want to do like sculptures and stuff, little top hat, the wings, the elf sort of things, um, the sort of Santa's belt. You know, there's sort of little fun things in here if you want to make sculptures and have a bit of other fun with it. So I'm going to briefly explain what fun is as well. I know you guys are probably sick of hearing it if you've watched a lot of my reviews, but I want to make sure everyone knows what's going on. So in a simple term, fun is basically a multi-use putty product. It's not a liquid and you use it for pretty much all your bathing needs. So you can use it as a shampoo. You can use it as a body wash. You can use it to leather uh, for shaving. You can use it as a bath colorant or a bath um, sort of bubble bath or just to scent the bath as well. You can use it for all of those things. My personal favourite is using it for shaving. That's the thing I really love using it for because it's nice creamy leather, not too thick, not too thin. Um, and the scent of this is quite strong as well. I would def I could definitely see this going really, really well um, as a bath product as well. But I didn't use it for that purpose. I'm just trying to keep these reviews on track. Just use it a little bit and see how I go with it. And I really enjoyed the scent and I thought it was perfectly awesome and fine. So there you go. Um, now the scent is just completely different to anything I know in Lush's range at the moment. Um, just, yeah, I don't know of any other sort of citrus scent at Lush currently that has that sort of candy-ish sweetness to it. A lot of them 
aren't super sweet. A lot of them just have a little bit of a sweetness or a natural sweetness, uh, but this is completely different. So I quite like finding something that's a bit of a surprise and a bit of a change for me because that's definitely what Festive Friends was. I really enjoyed it. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching this video. Oh, and five out of five. You already know. You already knew that. You didn't need me to say five out of five for a rating. You knew that. There you go. But yes, like I said, thank you for watching. I sincerely appreciate all the support I get on this channel. I promise I'm not always this scatterbrained. I I'm usually pretty good on this channel. Sometimes I stuff up, but I'm pretty good. But if you like this sort of casual, no nonsense sort of style of video, I sincerely hope you'll stick around and keep watching. Um, but yeah, until next time. Take care and I hope to see you then. Bye for now.